Federal Reserve Chairman Jerome Powell has confirmed that he sees a rate hike this month as appropriate, meaning that on March 15th, this is happening. Hello Cavaliers of Crypto and welcome to AB Crypto where we take a simple approach to break down the latest and most educative topics about the cryptocurrency market. If you're new to our channel, just hit that subscribe button below and hit the notification bell to receive any new video updates. You can also follow us on TikTok at underscore AB Crypto underscore. And if you want to read some more about today's topic, you can get the links down in the description below. So let's get started. First, let's discuss the footage of what Jerome Powell said. In a video released last week, the Federal Reserve Chairman has told U.S. lawmakers on Wednesday that the U.S. Central Bank is on track to raise interest rates this month for the first time in three years. This is due to high inflation, tight labor, and strong economic demand. In a direct quote, he said, With inflation well above 2% and a strong labor market, we expect that it will be appropriate to raise the target range for the federal funds rate at our meeting this month. Now, Powell didn't specify the size of the rate hike that he felt would be appropriate, and we can't confidently predict what an appropriate hike would be for the chairman, especially since inflation has kind of gotten out of control. As a result, many people think that the Federal Reserve is about to break crypto. They also think that Jerome Powell is about to crash Bitcoin. But you shouldn't be too afraid. But why? Well, the last time that we saw a succession of rate hikes was on December 14th of 2016, March 15th of 2017, June 14th of 2017, and December 13th of 2017. And within this period, Bitcoin skyrocketed from $1,000 to $20,000. Knowing this, do you think that the Federal Reserve would succeed in crashing Bitcoin? What we do know is that it would require a huge amount of energy to bring Bitcoin down, which could also pose a risk to the economy due to how invested a majority of the world is in this token. So Bitcoin will remain to be a major player and will still continue to lead the cryptocurrency market as the mother of all digital currencies. Well. Now that you understand that the Federal Reserve and Jerome Powell may not have the power to crash crypto, you can relax as we don't have to be afraid. Platforms like Bitcoin have a history of positive spikes in times like this. And finally, well, we're just here to remind you to always do your own research, as the information that we provide is made for you to grasp a basic understanding of crypto events. Well, this brings us to the end of today's video. We hope you guys found this video resourceful and entertaining. And if you have any more information to add to improve to the content in this video, please do so in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, and if you loved watching this video, send us those likes. We thank you guys for watching, and see you in our next video.